good these bad habits good these bad habits um it's so important that we recognize these things in our life what good and bad habits are right uh identifying them and then making a decision on what to do with them right a lot of us don't want to have this conversation the reason why we don't want to have this conversation is because bad habits feel fucking good right they offer instant gratification Things like smoking, drinking, eating shit, I don't know, watching porn, cheating. All of these things offer an instant reward for feeling glum and shitty, right? This is why we love fucking bad habits or we're so committed to them. But, 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 it's not all pros, right? Let's be honest, there's loads of cons. I've generalized it and said long-term self-destruct. Long-term destruction. Of course, if you continue all of these bad habits or a number of these bad habits over the long run, you're going to be fucked, right? And the complete opposite can be said for good habits. They tend to not offer much instant gratification, really, like eating a salad. You don't fucking instantly feel fantastic because you ate a salad. But the long-term benefits now, wow, what happens if you do healthy things regular for 10 to 20 years? You are a healthy person right? We, we all know this. I'm stating the obvious, but we all know this. But it's really important that you recognize that that little bit of fun from a bad habit has is long-term destruction, right? So how do you identify a bad habit? How do you not dress it up? For me, it's about asking yourself a number of questions, right? A number of questions. I go through a process all the time because what we do a good job of is dressing these bad habits up. It's a bit of fun. Oh, everybody does it right? We've done it. And if you've done that for 10, 20 years, then you're very unlikely all of a sudden just to say, oh, that's bad for me. So there's a step-by-step process asking questions, asking yourself questions as to what a bad and a good habit is. So for me, I recognized a few bad habits in my life by asking myself a simple question. Would I let my child do this? Would I be happy if my child did this? Absolutely not. When it comes to things like binge drinking on a weekend, spending excessive money, instantly gratified by it. I numb my brain. I'm fucking, I'm drunk. I don't have to think about my problems. Wake up Monday. I'm less money in my pocket. I'm struggling and I'm fucking feeling like a zombie. Would I let my child, would I want my child to do it? Absolutely not, right? Long-term side effects. Please, man, go through the process of looking at your long-term side effects. Even if you have to go and Google it, Look at the science, the background, the research, ask questions, the long-term effects to things like watching porn. I promise you, low testosterone, it's all out there, it's all proven. Identifying the bad habits, you have to ask yourself these ugly questions. Why I do this? A lot of our uh, bad habits are linked back to childhood trauma. You know, and I'm not here standing here as a therapist or a psychologist, but you have to recognize this. Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Why are you binge eating? Why are you obese? Why are you watching porn? Why do you spend money every payday on shit you don't need? Why are you doing it? Because you're low in self-esteem. Because your parents told you it was ugly. Because they told you you weren't shit. Because you felt like a dickhead in school. You got bullied at school. Real dark question that, right? And the last one is, do I feel guilty afterwards? If there's a habit out there and you feel guilty after it, constantly doing it. Cheating, again, porn, spending money, wasting money, drinking. You need to fucking identify that as a bad habit. So these are the four questions I ask myself in regards to habits. Uh, You can even bring in a third party or, sorry, someone else to have a discussion with uh, for a bit of accountability as well. But it's a great, uh, great start to ask yourself these four questions about your bad habits. Bad habits, these good habits, identifying them and then eradicating them. Thanks for watching.